Uh, welcome everyone. My name is Zhi Cheng Liu, a postgraduate student majoring in computer science at the University of Sydney. Today, I'm excited to present our latest research on enhancing multimodal sentiment analysis through the innovative use of ensemble pre-trained models, merging textual and video data. This approach is a collaborative effort with my esteemed colleagues, uh, Ali Briti, Ali Anisi, uh, Gui Fu, Ling Wing, and uh, Junan Akron. This research not only offers innovative solutions to the pain points in the field of sentiment analysis, but also demonstrates superior performance on multiple benchmark datasets, including MOS and MOSI. So uh, in the digital age, the interplay of text, visual, and sound in communication has never been more prevalent. Each layer adding depth to the inferred sentiment behind every interaction. Our work is driven by the goal to dive deeper into the uh, multimodal complexity, aiming to unra un unravel like, the sorry, sorry, Jason. Sentiment. Sorry, Jason. Just to interrupt you, so, uh, the slide is not uh, wasn't transiting. Okay, now it's okay. Oh, so uh, yeah, you can continue okay. from here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, uh, yeah, in the digital age, uh, the interplay of text, visual, and sound in communication has never been more prevalent. Each layer adding depth to the inferred sentiment behind every interaction. Our work is driving by the goal to delve deeper into multimodal complexity, aiming to un unravel the subtleties of sentiment conveyed through combined modalities. Um, so why this matters um, is, is that the motiva motivation behind our research is to push beyond the conventional boundaries of model design. Traditional sentiment analysis often relies on singular data types, mostly textual. However, combining different methods offer a unique opportunity to represent human emotions more authentically and subtly, which is a crucial advancement in areas ranging from automated customer service to real-time content moderation. Uh, our object is to explore and validate novel methods that integrate diverse data types more eff effectively through our research, uh, we aim to enhance the accuracy and the reliability of sentiment analysis tools, making them more adept at interpreting complex emotional cues in real-time scenarios. So let me briefly um, review the main methods of multimodal sentiment an analysis. This methods include extraction methods such as RN, CN, ResNet, BERT, VGG, and GPT-2. The application of these technologies enables us to understand and analyze emotional data more accurately and comprehensively. Our project is mainly used three data sets, which is widely used in MSC, is CMU MOSI, CMU MOS, and MELD. It is worth mentioning that uh, in addition to multimodal sentiment analysis, another important area of machine learning, ensemble models, um, ensemble models is also developing rapidly. As shown in the figure, uh, from 2014 to 2021, the annual growth rate of the number of papers on ensemble models has reached an astonishing stage of 36%, uh, of which papers in the field of computer science accounted for 35%. Um, the integrated model mainly includes four strategies, begging, voting, uh, and their stacking, uh, voting. This each of these strategies has its own characteristics, and the stacking methods is mainly used in our project, which allows us to more effectively utilize the advantages of different modalities and models. In recent years, more than 60% of ensemble model papers have focused on the field of sentiment analysis, but almost all of them only focus on a unique modality. In, in 2021, uh, Salu proposed a multimodal sentiment analysis ensemble model using soft voting in social media and graphic analysis. Mm, but it didn't involve common audio text and video analysis, analysis. Therefore, in our project, we try to explore the application of ensemble models in the field of multimodal sentiment analysis, aiming to fill this research gap. Um, so we use stacking ensemble strategy this, sophistic this sophisticated approach uniquely integrates three distinct base models. Firstly, the IFSA, which marries various deep texture um, comprehension with ResNet's hierarchical visual feature extraction. 
Secondly, the BFSA, leveraging GPT-2 for precise textual context, um, capturing alongside VGG for effectively visual recognition. And lastly, the TBJE model. Uh, it's harnessing uh, GLOVE and CNN that has demonstrated exceptional performance in the realm of sentiment analysis. These three models employ diverse architectures and pre-trained strategies, making them differentially sensitive to the varied patterns presenting data. These differentiated features underscore that when interpreting the same data with different models, we may obtain varying predictive outcomes. This is precisely why we choose to ensemble these models. Our goal is to combine the strengths of each model through stacking ensemble, and thus overcoming the limitations inherent in any single model. Now let's examine the performance of this strategy in practice. Uh, so our ensemble model has been rigorously tested on the widely recognized CMMOs and CMMOC datasets. In binary sentiment classification, our ensemble model in achieved an accuracy of 84.1% and an F1 score of 86.7% on the CMMOs datasets, demonstrating its precision uh, in distinguishing between positive and negative sentiments. On the CMU MOSI datasets, the model not only maintained an accuracy of 84%, but also uh, elevated its F1 score to 89.1%. In the more challenging seven class sentiment classification tasks, our, our model reached an accuracy of uh, 38% on CMU MOS and slightly decreased to 45.29% uh, on CMU MOSI. However, given the latter's complexity and the diversity, this performance reflects the model's significant strengths in real-world application. It proves our model's robustness and effectiveness in scenarios with broad emotional labels and rich expressions. Uh, and in our exploration of ensemble methods for multimodal sentiment analysis, uh, our evaluation study focused on four primary techniques. Stacking, bagging, boosting, and voting. The results illustrated that stacking emerged as the most effective method, achieving the highest F1 score of 0.892 and an accuracy of um, two classes of uh, 0.84. This confirms our hypothesis that stacking, by leveraging the strengths of multiple models, um, provides a more nuanced interpretation of complex multimodal data. Within the stacking framework, we experimented with various combinations of our three base models, IFSA, BFSA, and the TBJE for more granular sentiment classifications involving seven different classes. Our ensemble model exhibited promising results, managing an accuracy of seven class of 0.453, demonstrating significant improvements over individual models performance this showcases our ensemble's capability uh, in handling more detailed and varied emotion, emotional states. So in conclusion, um, the integration of fundamental model IFSA, BFSA, and the TPJE while advanced in the ensemble technologies underlines their potent synergy uh, achievement, uh, achievable through combining diverse model analytical strengths this synergy effectively addresses the announced challenge of detecting complex emotional states in multimodal contexts. These findings not only contribute to the academic discourse, but also set a new precedent for future research aimed at integrating multimodal data sources more effectively. So thank you for listening, and I hope our research inspires and stimulates further thoughts. For more details, please read our paper. Thank you once again, um, and I look forward to further discussions with, with you all. Thank you.